Alright, so now we're on to the last of the Action Driver sets, the Fire Station. It comes with just one vehicle, the Blaze Blitzer, and this one is a re-release from, I believe, 2015 or 2016. It definitely came in a 5-pack. I'm thinking an airport 5-pack, maybe? So, that's a negative, but... It doesn't matter because we probably everybody probably already has a ton of fire trucks anyway that we can put in there that we want instead. So this set I definitely think is my favorite of the three. As you can see, it's got a road on the front and like a side street here. Let's zoom into the tower there. We got a guy on a treadmill with his oxygen tank. I definitely feel like that is a picture they took and then applied it to a label, which is pretty neat. As you can see, it's Fire Station 2-1, or 2021. And it looks like in the bottom there we got Dispatch, possibly. Again, the doors look awesome on this, I love it. As you can see, we've got two bays, and we got up there a, like a skylight, kind of. As you can see, the, that would be the simulated uh, ceiling of the building. And that's not quite the Fire District logo, but I'll take it. It's still the typical, uh, I'm not sure what this actual symbol is. It's not the, is it the Maltese cross? I, I don't know, I'm not too sure. But, yeah, we got a traffic light. We got two parking spots there. And here we have the training tower on the end here. It's like a real thing where they have like a, you've probably seen them before where it's like a, a fake looking building where they train for fires like, and a piece of fire comes up and to put out the fire you take your fire truck launch it through and there puts out the fire um, pretty neat, uh, these stickers right here were pretty tough to apply, these are those were not applied you would apply those yourself, and they're very, very thin, but I think I did a pretty good job. If we can zoom in on those a little bit. A training tower. And let's take a look at the actual interior here. Uh, the white pieces here, you see this, this, and this. And this. These are permanent installs. It has that in the instructions. It tells you, like, some of the stuff you can't rip out uh, when you're not supposed to be able to. I bet you could, but you'd break it. But we have actually, there's actually quite a lot of room in here for more vehicles. Like, you're meant to, you're meant to fill this up, I feel like. And as you can see, um, if I can uh, get them to show here, we got materials on the ground. It looks like we got... Looks like we got the Jaws of Life right there. Uh, jacket, I'm not, I'm not really sure what the, I don't actually know what the fire department jackets are called. And looks like we got various equipment on the ground there. We got stuff, stuff over, over there. And we got the rack with the jackets right there. Again, that definitely looks like a picture they just took and applied it to a label, which is pretty neat if that's how it actually is. Got like a pipe right there, I'm not sure what this is. Maybe it's like you load foam with it or something. I'm not, I'm not sure. But um, another feature of this set is you see this speaker up here. This set does make sound. And how you get it to either make sounds is there's a couple options. You can either press this up here, which I'll demonstrate. There you go, you can do that, or you can take your fire truck, and as with the other sets, there's those levers in the ground like I've talked about. You will activate them. Or I guess it didn't do it that time, but let's... Oh, okay. Well, it didn't do it that time. It did it before. Let's try it again. There we go. There you have it. Uh, it's actually pretty loud, and it, I think it's had uh, five different uh, sentences, it said, like five different uh, dialogues. 
but let's actually throw some of my own vehicles in here because as you know I got all my fire some of my fire district cars here this down here is a parking spot as you may be able to see right there we got the letter P so put my nice old 96 Crown Vic in there so what's this one called fire ladder truck we'll put that as engine one and they sit nicely right there they're not rolling back at all they do just sit sit there excuse me and we'll have an international pumper right next to it and we can put this mini pumper right here in the training tower and why not we'll just put this uh, bus Chevy bus right behind it and in the middle there you've, you've got a little actual air pump as similar to the one in the gas station back there and this and this thing right here that I mentioned earlier the like I guess foam pump or whatever you want to call that thing there's a gate in the back there for you to I guess connect to another set or whatever because all these things connect together they're modular I guess you call it with these uh, these right here you can see all these like hook ends but uh, yeah without a doubt this one's my favorite or I guess they do kind of roll back there just a little bit but yeah um got a gate right there that's the tiny sticker right there I had to apply the like, no entrance sticker there but overall this this set is uh, this one's definitely my favorite no no uh, no more of the days where we have to find an old box for our, to make our fire stations out of we actually have a actual fire station now now I, they've done play sets in the past but like impossible to find you know, there's just no way you'll ever find them you find the exclusive vehicles for instance I think that I think this may have been exclusive in a in a place that back in the day this truck because it's got the old fire district logo but you know, let's, hear, let's hear let's see if it makes another sound Yeah, so there you have it. Um, this one's this one's great, and you got two parking spots for civilians right there. This one's definitely my favorite of the three. It's not too bad to assemble. I think the hospital was the worst, and the and the uh, fuel station's the easiest. But that's gonna do it for this review of all three of these. They're really neat, and I'm hoping to find more. They'll probably release more. I, I don't know if there's more because I found out about these no joke yesterday and I'm like okay where are they target okay and I found out went out and got them so yeah we've got these and you know what else they're bringing back they're bringing back hitchin hauls which will be interesting there's two sets that I've seen of hitchin hauls so far but those remain to be seen and when I find them I will bring them to you so thank you guys for sticking with my rambling video here my rambling review of the action drivers fire station and all three of them Thank you guys for watching.